Robert Nemitz. Uh, Mayor, council members, thank you for your time today. Uh, I'm, my name is Robert Nimitz. I'm here on behalf of the homeowners of Mountain Vale Ranch. We're, advoc we're advocating for funding for a stoplight at the intersection of Atterbury Washway and Mary Ann Cleveland. Um, over the past three years, there have been several accidents at this intersection, including more recently in the past three months, two involving uh, school buses that have been seriously damaged. We've approached the city for funding for this particular intersection to place a stoplight there. And so far we've hit the stoplight in getting funding for this intersection. Um, Shirley Scott's office, Councilwoman Shirley Scott's office has been advocating for a stoplight at this intersection. I've been the first to been very, uh, um, I've been the first that's been um, not so welcoming of her office and I'd like to thank her office for work, for the work that she's done because they have completely turned around from where we we're at to where we're at now. Uh, the developer, as far as my understanding, the developer has, pay, has offered to pay for the, uh, uh, for the design work at the proposed uh, stoplight. There have been a lot of phone calls between Shirley Scott's office as well as her constituents in the city. Um, we're really trying to get this intersection uh, corrected so that way ultimately safety of not only the students at Esmond, Esmond Station, but as well as those who live in the area can ultimately navigate through the intersection without having to worry about whether they're gonna get hit because if a car's going high speed or have to gun it through the intersection of the, where the stop signs are because of the fact that there is a lot of oncoming traffic. The further, what's further uh, complicating the intersection is we have students who are a thousand, who live a thousand feet away from, or a thousand meters away from where their school's at, but they have to take a 45 minute bus ride to go to school because they cannot safely cross the intersection. Um, at this point, we're trying to seek funding for this as well as a commitment for funding. And uh, at this current time, that commitment has not happened, even though the uh, community has overwhelmingly uh, seeked out for, um, to, get you, to get funding for this project. Uh, with that, I yield the balance of my time back to the council members. All right, thank you, sir, thank you. appreciate it. Mr. Manager, uh, we can't be the city that doesn't handle things when there's wrecks with bu uh, school buses involved. We need to make sure we address this. Um, Keith Van Hunnigan. 